Hello everybody, welcome to today's video. Today we are going to be installing a simple resource um, from the tutorials that I write. Um, so we're going to be choosing the basic, basic script one today. Um, it's just a basic script, pretty straightforward on how to do it. So, the instructions worded are here. I'll put a link in the, in the description below if you don't have that anymore. And uh, we'll get right into this. So, pretty much what you want to do is you want to head over into the releases section where all the you know the mods and everything are like that are um so in here you got all these resources all of them are all different in their own ways they all do their own thing you know that one would jail people that one's a car pack that one's a police station you know that one's a satellite 3d map that one's a live map anyway so Go ahead and um, find a script that you choose. Admin reply, that, that would make a good example. Admin group chat, another good example. Um, ID only for admin, another good example. Anyway, so once you have your chosen one, we're gonna be using the quit command, one that I made here. Um, so yeah, we're gonna do this today. And so pretty much what you wanna do is you just wanna download it, use direct download or GitHub. Everyone has their own options. Um, and then we'll open up that folder and what we're going to do is we're going to drag it onto the desktop It's going to be a raw file. So you want to make sure you have um, 7-zip I think can do it or WinRAR is what I use and we can do it like that Anyway, so wait, get rid of that thing there What you want to do is you want to open up your WinRAR folder or your file and also get into your server I am using a VPS for this. This is what I use to browse my VPS server. It's a Ubuntu server um, but the file paths should be very similar hopefully for Windows as well um, so yeah I'm not too sure about zap hosting and all that sort of stuff that's there should be an upload button on those things I believe not a hundred percent sure always feel free to contact um, zap hosting support or whatever so what you do all resources go into the resources folder so most commonly you can put that in server data and then resources right here I'll drag it in the middle so you guys can see it a little bit better. Right here is where all your resources will go. You can put them in this folder, or you're also able to make a new uh, new directory, square bracket it, and call it whatever, right? Call it whatever you want and close the square bracket. The square bracket means 5M will just bypass that and look in this folder. So, um, in this bracket, um, you can put it under server, you can put it under anything we are going to put quit server in there. Um, so yeah, pretty basic script, just forward slash quit and it quits the game. That's pretty much all the script does. What you want to do is you want to upload the folder. Um, most resources come in a folder or they might just come as those um, there. So you just want to make a folder here if it doesn't have one. But uh, we have the folder there, so we're just going to drag and drop it in. Here's your resource. So your resource is now inside the server. Um, this file, as you probably read a little bit above in the tutorial, this has everything you need, right? So, um, well not everything you need, but this loads the, the resource itself. So, to make the resource load, sorry, to make the resource load when you start your server, now that that's in here, the folder is called quit server. See that right there? It's called quit server. So, what we're going to do is we're going to go back to server data. Don't pay attention to all this here, really. And you want to open your server.config. In here, you have all, it should look something like this. Um, in your group of starts here is where you want to put the new resource. So you can type in start. Is it quit server that it was called? Yes, it is. Quit server. You can type it in just like so. Make sure you save it. That's going to do its thing. Now we're going to start that resource up. I'm going to use Archon um, on the server, but you can use whatever methods you have. If you have a, a shell or something you can do, or a command prompt, um, that's totally up to you. But we're going to refresh. Make sure you refresh them if you want to start it straight away. The server must set Archon to be able to use this command. Well, the server doesn't have an Archon, so that's... That's fantastic. So what we're going to do is I'm going to log into my thing here and we'll be right back. Alright, we are in the server. This is that thing that just put out Narcon. So I'm just going to shut the server off. You can restart it. You can start the resource itself if you know how to do that. But right here I'm going to restart the whole server itself. So 
There you go, it's gonna restart. You should say, it says here, started resource, quit server, no errors underneath it, and the server just started up. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna launch um, 5M. Okay, we are now inside the server. So, obviously you wanna test your resource now that you've put it into the server. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna type forward slash quit, and it, was, it even says there is a suggestion actually, if you put a forward slash in, um, because I have them as suggestions in the resource. So, um, you can type forward slash quit, which it says there, it says quit 5M. There you go, we just quit 5M. So that means the resource fully works meaning we've installed it correctly. If you haven't installed it correctly, I suggest re-watching this video or going through the steps nice and thoroughly in the tutorial itself. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you in the next tutorial. Take care.